Hey guys, my name is Samsonite, and welcome back to Vampire. Now I know what you're thinking, Sam, this isn't where we left off. This is different. Well, I looked up a thing, and I found out that one of the best weapons in the game is called the Surgical Hacksaw, and you can find it somewhere in this hospital. I really don't want to keep... I didn't even know there was a third floor. Uh, well, there's technically not. Okay, so basically, I'm going to be doing a lot of side missions and stuff. I want to get to at least level 25 before taking on Doris Fletcher. She's a beast. Like a real beast. Um, yes, I'm still fully intending on... I cannot enter. <clears throat> uh, murdering everybody. Don't even worry about that. Um... Every person in the game will be dead at some point. Because of me. What are you doing? Oh. It's locked, alright. It's locked. I could kill her right now. Oh, I don't think I should start the episode like that, though. See, that's the thing. I feel really... The cats are going nuts. Again. <laughs> Every time I record, they go nuts. I don't know why, but they just do. Uh, I feel like I missed it. I feel like the cats are just going crazy. Uh, I feel like it's called the Surgical Hacksaw. And I want it. They said it, like, it's powerful and it, uh, replenishes blood as you fight. Those are two things that I like. What does this say? Here's what the guide says, uh, on the first floor of the Pembroke Hospital. It has a high attack speed and decent durability. I don't think durability is a thing in this game. Although it may not deal very high damage after improving his weaponry and getting the suck blood on impact, it significantly strengthens Jonathan. I want that. Whoops. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good. Goodbye. Goodbye, Nurse. <laughs> Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. <laughs> Goodbye, Nurse Hawkins. <laughs> Yeah, well, that, it'd be like that sometimes. Oh, hey, look, it's the woman I'm working on murdering. Small bag of junk. Wow. I can't find the surgical hacksaw I'm supposed to be finding in here. <clears throat> you have to stop complaining like that, otherwise I'm going to mesmerize you. I'm going to... Okay, I can't find it, so let's find that dude on the outside of the place that sells weapons. Maybe he's got something that's better than what I've been using. And then I'm gonna start murdering people! Yum, yum, yum! Let's see, can I find someone that's not, like, afflicted by something? Oh, she's got the thing of fatigue and he's got a headache. Oh! You. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening. Wait, I'm gonna make sure there's no gold. Pepper. Yes. I have oh no, I've already done this. Here we go. This is what you guys have asked for. Being clear. This music makes me feel guilty. But at the same time, it's okay. I knew I should have fled this rotten city with Milton since the first day of the contagion. Hmm. Wait. Okay, I feel guilty for doing this, though. Like, I feel, like, genuinely guilty. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to bring myself to do it. Uh, I'll, I'll be fine. I'll be able to do it. Um, got a lot of experience for doing that. Oh, there he is. Jeez. Good evening, Milton. Good evening, Doctor. Still trying to save lives. 
Sure. Do you need any medical help? I'm afraid I do. Look. I have that. Our job brings us into contact with all kinds. That's easy. Oh. I'd like to see your goods. Wise choice, Dr. Reed. I re what you got? You ain't got sh Oh, that's cell. I have a better shotgun than that. Oh my god, I need that. Um, how about all of them? Wait. Common good handle part. I feel like I need that. I don't know if I actually need that. Thanks. Okay, so I killed someone. Should I kill one more person? No, because look, this district, the cats are going crazy, and I apologize. Uh, yeah, this just this district's easily gonna get pushed into critical. Uh, maybe even hostile. I don't know. Um, I'm not gonna evolve until I have to though, to avoid that. Um, let's do some side missions. See what I can run into. Um. Local investigations. These are all done. Ah, yes. I have to go... Uh, get her home. It's 200 meters that way. If she doesn't... If I can't convince her to go back to... Mm, to Whitechapel, then I'm literally just going to eat her, and then that will be that. Because I've been asked to do a full dark playthrough. It's what you guys wanted. <laughs> Please don't hate me. Uh, let's see. Okay. I don't feel right doing this. It makes me feel bad. I can't believe I'm doing this. Gonna walk next to you. Ha! Damn, I'm good. Got right on around him. Whoopsie daisy. Don't come closer. I'm not going around you. Don't come closer, sir. Okay, here we go. Oh! <laughs> yummy, yummy! I love this game, by the way. I'm gonna be playing uh, the the super happy, nice version, like in my own time. Uh, or should I be playing it now? Honestly, no, no. Because everyone on YouTube plays the happy, nice version. I'm the dark version. I get to be Dracula. Also, my neck is still kind of screwed up. I slept on it wrong, and it's been stiff, and it's better than it was, but the cape's still draped over the chair as opposed to wearing it. It's a good thing I'm not a gentleman. Okay. All right. Whether you live or not, ah, shit, you got bronchitis. Hello. Hello. I don't have that. Goodbye. Damn it! I gotta walk. Wait. Oh god, I gotta go all the way back to the freaking hospital. Ugh. I gotta go back to the hospital and treat her, so that way I get more experience. It makes me angry that I have to do this. But I'm bringing you along with me, so you have to experience it with me. I don't like doing things I hate alone. This isn't where I need to be, is it? No, but there's a dead boy. Oh, you know what? I'll leave you to it. You, you seem busy. Um, there's a lot of rats here. Nasty, nasty, nasty. Just gonna book it through the graveyard. There we go. 
I already killed the dude on the way in. So I should be able just to run, right? Run home? Correct? Yes. Should I be up here? Is this somewhere I need to be? Die for me. No. I like being able to do that. See, I want that more places. I need to go the way I'm facing. That's where... Damn it. Ow. That was cool. Damn, I'm good. Alright, now that they're dead, I can just run straight into the hospital. Make the cure for bronchitis, give it to her, and then eat her. Gonna start munching on the souls. I feel so bad, though. I know I shouldn't be doing this. I know I shouldn't be doing this. I should have one for of everything, honestly. Just in case I need it, you know? Okay. Back to where I was going. Like, I mean, even if I don't eat her, I need to cure the bronchitis. So... There's that. Man, I feel so bad. But at the same time... I've never done a dark playthrough on something. I have to keep justifying it to myself because I don't want to kill the characters that I like, but at the same time, if I'm going to kill any characters, I'm going to kill the ones that I'm going to kill them all. It, this is just such a beautiful game, and I hate to just go around murdering everything instead of experiencing it for what it's supposed to be. The cats are flipping their shit right now. Why was this an option? It's such a stupid... There's nothing here. Nothing. The cats. They're driving me crazy. Hello again. Hello again. How do you... F I... There you go. You should recover quickly. Thank you. How is the sanitary situation evolving in Whitechapel these days? My only relief is that my Matthew died before seeing the madness that approaches. Can I convince you to go? You should go home. I think you Thank you for your company. Maybe I'll see you. Oh, that's it? Goodbye. That was it. Okay, so now that I've beaten her thing, I can eat her, right? Maybe I'll see you at that's done what other side missions do I got this one this one I just have to find people to that read Braille I know I understand I'm trying to push this whole game over the brink Huh. 
So why do I need braille again? I can't remember. Oh, they're outside of the... Damn it! I hate this map, okay? It's hard to... Damn it! I forget that. I hate fighting teleporty boys. I hate it. This is the way I need to go. Correct? Damn it. This way. I'm gonna kill everyone. In the game. Uh, I hope you... If you guys start, like, saying no, please stop. I want you to know that not only is this path already been chosen, but it will only make me feel guilty. <laughs> please don't. I am going to play this again in my spare time to get the full uh, effect of it. So I want... I'm afraid to evolve because then the district's healths will drop. Okay, so it seems like right in here somewhere is where the next braille person is. Don't want to deal with it. Good night. It's in there. It's in this building here somewhere. I don't know how to get in there, though. Good evening, sir. It's me again. Leave me alone, I say, whoever you are. It cannot be safe for a blind man to live here alone. Let me enter, sir. I swear I mean you no harm. Well, a voice never lies, and yours clearly is the voice of a gentleman. All right, Doctor, come on in. What kind of gentleman pays visits to people at this late hour? The vampire kind. So what is the name of my nocturnal visitor? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. As I already explained to you, I'm inquiring about the epidemic. Dr. Reed? The eminent surgeon? My god! I'd never have expected a brilliant physician like you to knock on my door. You flatter me, sir. No, sir, I am flattered. I read all your work when I still had my sight. I loved it. I'm Mason Swanborough, by the way. Do you know Braille, Mr. Swanborough? I'm no expert, but I learned it in my spare time, yes. Why? I found a strange document entitled Cure for Blindness. It's written in Braille, so I thought perhaps it was yours. Really? Is that some kind of sick joke? Let me see. Here it is. This letter seems authentic. And it actually refers to an experimental cure for blindness. You have piqued my interest, Dr. Reed. Could it be of any use to you? No. This page is just a part of a larger diary. I'd be glad if you could find the other pages. Ah. Oh. You seem unwell, sir. Do you need my assistance? Actually, I feel worse than usual. Can you give me something? No, not now. Later, perhaps. Oh. Does someone take care of you in this isolated place? My sister Loretta and I have our daily... Okay. So, uh... Goodbye. Basically, this was a waste of time. Wandering in this part of town at night, you're either brave or a fool. Don't worry about it. I'm it's locked, all right. All I'm doing is taking stuff, roaming around. What is it? How do you see the world these days? With my eyes. You remember that? When you could do that. Okay, good night. So weak. Oh. Ah. 
got no idea, bro, what you're messing with here. I'm a doctor after all. Okay, so basically I can't do anything about that until I find more braille notes. Um, so I think what I'm going to have to do is... Uh, just, oh shit, I need to, I was gonna say move forward in the quest line, but I'm not strong enough, so I might have to evolve. Oh! Nice! Um, nice. Okay, let's see if I can upgrade this. Good handle part and lead rods. Okay, um... Oh wait, let's make health... Uh... Oh... Uh, that's stamina, blood, blood... Ooh... Okay, so I can... That ain't bad at all. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is equip those things. Uh, regeneration and light regeneration. Okay, that's good. Uh, I'll evolve and then I'll go see if I can beat Doris. Uh, what would help with that? Uh, more health? Yes, for sure. Plus 500 health? That's quite a bit. Okay, these are done. These two are done. Uh, oh shit, my blood's so low, man. So low. No, low, low, low. Um. Hmm. What would help me in this fight in particular? Juicing up my ultimate. I need 3,000 for that, and I don't have 3,000. Let's see. More blood would definitely help. More blood would definitely help. I might go with more blood. Increase your blood absorption when using the bite. Or just the overall amount of blood I can hold. Yeah, this one I'll be able to go into the fight with more blood. Okay. We'll confirm that. <clears throat> Let's see the damage. Come on. Sorry. Oh my god, I'm gonna push them into hostile. Oh no, I didn't push them into hostile somehow. Hey, I ain't gonna argue. Now I'm gonna make sure I'm recording because for some reason I have this like deep feeling in my soul that I'm not, but I am. So, hey, let's go see if we can beat Dorothy now with double the amount of blood I normally have. Ow. I'm trying to adjust myself. Uh, I gotta. Get into a stuffle with some bad boys. The cats. I don't even know if you guys can hear them, but I can hear them through my like movie theater headphones. Over there. I was walking though. I didn't mean to use that. So I'm basically back where I started. That's probably fine. Let's see. Uh, oh, that's a long walk. Okay. Well, I'll definitely get into a fight on the way there and fill up the blood bar. Ooh, I didn't mean to. You can say how dare you all you want. I genuinely had no idea you were here. He was so much easier this time around. <gasps> I'm level 25 instead of 22. Or 21. What was I? You know what? Will you, though? Ow. Hey, you're on the way, that's for sure. Ow. Yum, 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 yum. Cool. <laughs> My blood's already almost full. 
There's a baby crying. Is that just me, or is there a baby crying? Always in that area. That's cute. Oh, oh. I'll show you how to defend territory like this. This whole city's my territory, bitch. I got a good trigger part out of him. Alright, so now if I can... Oh, that was close. That was undeniably close. No, it's not. No, and it really isn't. Uh-oh. That's big and scary. Woo. Woo. Out, cats. Didn't really want to deal with this shit right now, but that, I guess this is fine. I don't want to use all my blood to heal, but I might need to use all my blood to heal. Well, not all of it. I have, I'm going to have to upgrade that heal. You're cute. That was... I was hoping that would give me blood. Instead, it did the exact opposite. What are you two doing? <sighs> the kittens, specifically. Tangy and Lilith. We have Cayman, Scuba, Kumo, Tangy, Lilith. We have five cats now. We're attempting to get rid of Kumo, though. She doesn't get along. She beats the shit out of the other cats because... She was abused before, we think. And it's sad, but I don't think she's happy here. You know what I mean? Like she's just not getting along with them. She only gets along with Michaela. No one else. She bit her mom. Like Michaela's mom. She bit Kumo. Bit Michaela's mom. She always bites me, and it's like, dude, look, you're not happy. That's fine. It's not fine. I want her to be happy, so. It's locked. So it's locked. I cannot enter. Hmm. This is what I need. I have this thirst for blood. Saying that to me like I haven't been playing this whole game with you. Woe unto thee, son okay. of Whoa! I did not expect. I ate two people. I ate two different people to, to, to juice up for this fight. Behold, Kinslayer, the disgrace of sheep. Will she be the queen again once they all share her fate? Wait a sec. Wait. How do I equip weapons? This, this, here. Nope. Yeah. Oh wait, I gotta unequip this. For my second highest damage, this. Nope. Ha! 
Shit. Shit. Oh god. Oh shit, shit. I was distracted by... There was no distractions. I can't blame this on anything but myself. <laughs> okay, suffering is a part of the immortal condition. The pain will never stop. Wow. Well, I just died, so... Does it really apply to me? I feel like I need to go into this. I need to go into this with this. I can just eat the rats. I don't need to fight those boys. Num num num. This is despicable. Is it? I do need more blood than this. It's locked. I like the way he speaks. Alright, no more. Okay, so she's prone to getting shot. I could have told you that. I guess I do need to... Ow! I need blood, bruh. Allow me. To drink. Get off. That's what I wanted. <sighs> well, my health is regening. I didn't know it did that. Um, is there? Who is that? Oh, I have this thirst for blood. I do like his voice. I'm gonna search around for another rat or two. Hang on, I gotta juice myself back up. This is all gun this is like the hardest boss fight I've I've had to fight so far. And then the next thing I'm gonna put all of my murder people points into is definitely um despicable. Definitely that heal. It doesn't do nearly enough. Like it used to, but that was back when I had a tiny health bar. Is there anything else? Yeah, I, I, I see Doris Fletcher. Maybe if I go into the fight... Um, 72... Maybe if I just go into the fight with that, have it loaded and ready... There we go. Woe unto these. So that worked pretty well. Oh. See, I'm already got her almost half dead. Behold, Kingslayer, the disgrace of that didn't work quite as well. Will she be the queen again once they all share her fate? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, so. Ne oh. Oh, that's cool. Okay, now I have a shot here. and save your my Save? Implying you need saving. Implying I'm doing good. 
Did I? I don't remember doing that. I don't remember that. I don't know what she's talking about. I'm dying. I'm dying hard. Oh, blood. I'm dying. Wait. Use that. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, shit. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I was working on it! Damn it. Okay, okay. I am gonna go at her with the shotgun and then instead of trying to beat her up I'm going to shoot her a lot that might work okay it's loaded it's ready I do need blood though A bunch of it. I can't believe I'm doing this. Now they spawn relatively quickly up in here. So now I do have a pistol, correct? It's not very good, but it'll do, I think. I hope. I need more blood than this. If I could kill her, there it is. If I could kill Doris, I have this thirst for blood. It's that last like quarter of her health that I gotta get past. Quit screaming! I need at least one more. Come on now. Come on! I know you want to spawn. There you are. This I'll do one more. Despicable. Itchy. Itchy. Now, I might also... <laughs> if I die like two more times, what I'll do is I will go eat someone else of high value and then upgrade again. I have this thirst for blood. I know you do. Here we go. Your blood will be Behold, King Slayer, the disgrace of sheep will Scuba! I apologize. I missed. Wait. It's once the ads start is when bad shit happens. That ain't even worth it, man. It's legit not even worth it. Am I a villain yet? I don't know. Jury's still out on that one. Definitely ain't no Dark Prince. I'd been bragging about that. Blood, 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 blood. Oh, I see what I did wrong. I haven't done this yet. Ah, why are you here? Stop. I summon thee, my children of the night. Fight! Pain! Smit! Kill! He's almost dead. I'm almost dead, though. Got her! 
Oh! Uh, wait. Your face I is messed up. Wait. What? I... I don't want to die. And I did not come to kill you, Miss Fletcher. Will you spare me then? No. Save this cadaverous carcass of mine. No. Does your heart beat a little faster now? You fancy me then, Doctor? No, I'm no, gonna... Miss Fletcher. My dead heart will beat for only one. Ah! Is she pretty? Is she sweet and tender? To me, yes. Ah! <laughs> I hate her already. I know. And this is partly why you must be destroyed. But you just said... That I did not come here to kill you, yes. But I realize now the threat you embody must be stopped. She reminds me of Nightmare Will from Soul Calibur. Will you? You were Doris Fletcher, the greatest actress of her generation. No one can take that from you. Thank you. And farewell. Well, farewell, Doris. I mean, it's not exactly a loss. I came here to do that myself. <laughs> Bravo! So dramatic! I love it! Who are you? McCullum. How strange I seem to find you whenever I'm inquiring about that skull infestation. I mean you no harm. I'm not here for you. But once I've put all the pieces of the puzzle together, I'm sure we'll have a little chat. You and me. Stay away from me, McCullum. You and all your war dogs. That I can't guarantee, Dr. Reed. But I'll let you go. For now. I so, should probably leave the theater right now. So there's escape. It's locked, all right. What do I have to escape? The West End should be safe now. But London is not. It would be wise to benefit from the Ascalon's protection. While I continue my research during the great hunt. Okay. That's fine. I'm being licked by a cat. Come on, Scoop, stop. Okay, so... I didn't check... How much experience I had, but that was a really tough boss fight, and it was five levels above me, so I had to. I would have to guess that it was at least a couple thousand. It was exactly a couple thousand. These it was two thousand. Won't be dead. I need to leave now. Gonna be lots of human fighting. So Doris just needed to be close to her audience to infect. Contagion I'm in chapter five. There's only six chapters in the game. I might be taking it easy on the killing humans now, but once I hit chapter six, if I haven't murdered everyone already, I definitely will be. I apologize if I kill the wrong person at the wrong time. to Lord Redgrave about Doris Fletcher. I'm gonna kill Redgrave, too. Uh... Do I have a migraine cure for you yet? Good evening. I won't. Do you need medics a little? I will... Okay. You need... I gotta go in here and talk to Redgrave. 
Must be in bed to spend... I know! I'm gonna need to murder everybody. My mesmerize level's pretty high. I have Gooba's tail. Six. Damn. What am I at? Four or five? Four still. Do, 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 do. What does this creepy old misogynistic man have to say to me? He's not here. Straight up not here. It's two meters this way. This is like literally where I need to be. And he's not here. There he is. He's over here. Welcome back to the Ascalon Club, Lance Bearer. Please, tell us the good news. Have you put an end to the epidemic? My hypothesis was correct. Doris Fletcher was the source of the contagion in this part of town. She was probably the first to be infected. And you cleansed her before the hunters, I've been told. Well done, Dr. Reed. You thrust your lance and pierced the very heart of the corruption. But some questions remain. The important thing is, we won a major battle for the survival of London. For that, we salute you. Thank you, my lord. Now, I have another task. Oh, I hate this guy. One of the utmost importance. Perhaps even more so than the previous. I'm listening. It's time for you to perform a most sacred duty for the club. I want you to recruit a new vampire. No. Recruit a new vampire? Are you sending me on some sort of diplomatic mission? Not exactly. I want you to make Aloysius Dawson the Ekon he deserves to be. No. I'm sorry, but I can't. Are you questioning my orders? No. It's just... I'm not sure I'm ready to have another progeny after what happened with my sister. The rebirth of Aloysius Dawson? is a necessary step in our campaign to ensure the safety of London. How would you like me to proceed? Aloysius is waiting for you at the Dawson Estate. Once the deed is done, I'll join you there to celebrate this momentous occasion. Before I go, I have a few questions. All right, I'm listening. Why Aloysius Dawson? Because he is about to die. And he just may be the most influential man in England. After me, of course. Does he know I'm coming? He can't wait to become your progeny, Dr. Reed. Did he choose me? No, I did. My decision is very recent, to say the least. But it is entirely mine. Mm. Goodbye. I'm gonna kill him if I can. I don't like him. I don't like doing what I'm told. I can't stand it, actually. Where's the where's the way out? Hmm. Are you all right, Jonathan? Lord Redgrave has just ordered me to turn Aloysius Dawson. To make him my progeny. I see. And how do you feel about this? Bad. I'd like your advice on the matter. The real question here is, why has his lordship given you this task? Do you think it's some sort of trap? Do you really want to know what I think about this? I do, yes. To make an immortal of a soulless blackguard like Aloysius Dawson will only lead to a disaster for London. The man is already dead inside. Should I refuse? Perhaps politely suggest that Lord Redgrave turn the man into a vampire himself. Don't you dare, my dear. According to what I've recently discovered, his lordship could kill you for even broaching the subject. Really? Why? I've recently found proof that the Earl of Bristol is of lesser lineage and only capable of creating skulls. 
Please tell as long as you low. Are you sure your information about Redgrave is correct? He says he's the progeny of the great knight William Marshall, who lived some nine centuries ago. That's a lie. Lord Redgrave is unable to create anything but skulls, if the poor soul survive at all. How can you be sure the information was correct? That's... I made the I'm gonna go make fun of him right now. ...of a most interesting informer while investigating your maker, from whom I learned the truth about Lord Redgrave. Goodbye for now, Elizabeth. Goodbye, my dear. I'm gonna go upstairs. And I'm gonna go out him. This might be a mistake, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Understandably, you have questions. Very. You invited Lady Ashbury. Wouldn't that be breaking one of your cardinal rules? No women allowed. Not allowed as members, no. But considering the circumstances, I thought you'd like to have her here to witness your triumph. So it's a temporary admittance. Then. Something of a bargain, considering the crisis we're currently facing. How would you... Don't what? So shall I just let him drink my blood? Yes. Is there... Oh, blood. Okay, so I can't mock him for not being able to do the things he says he can. Okay, well, this piece of shit's gonna die, and I'm gonna make, be the one to do it if I can help it. Okay. I do want to eat someone as well. I'm starting to, like, eliminate the prominent characters, which makes me sad because I enjoy all of these characters, but at the same time, I've committed to a jet-black playthrough. So... It's only fitting for the um, biggest fan of Dracula to have a Dracula-esque playthrough. It looks like vampires have to obey Mendel's laws when producing progeny. Powers pass from one generation to another. That's why Dawson wants me to sire him. I'm gonna try and kill him instead. Because then that means someone as strong as me gets to live. Speaking of clothes, this will look tough. Watch out for the teeth. Ah. up there. Trying to figure out how to get down here. Eh. I don't like being called names. Just said I don't like being called names, so I'm gonna beat the shit out of you until you die because you called me a name. Sounds fair to me. Find another way to get into the neighborhood. 
Of course. About to do this with you, buddy. I think that this passage could lead me close to Aloysius Dawson's mansion. What passage, though? Stupid newborn! Ah! Oh. Of course, it's freaking sewers. Let me... More sewers. Oh, hey, Lilith. You, can, you guys can probably see Lilith, or at least her Halloween body. She's orange and brown, orange and black. Makes me happy. She's a little Halloween cat. She's my Halloween kitty. And then Scooby's my little trash cat. Alright, unnatural selection. Yeah, you ain't lying. Why sewers, though? I hate sewers. I make that known that I hate sewers. I think this will be the last mission it's I do in life. this video. Just so you guys know, there is a light at the end of the tunnel. Leon... Is this Big Boy? From, like, ages ago? I shouldn't have done that. Ah. Oof. This bitch is level 32. Die. Itchy. Dang it, get away. 500. This guy ain't shit, really. Yet, anyway. Unless he's got, like... Hi, Tangy. All of the cats are just laying on the desk now. Oof. Oh no, he's gonna heal with this, isn't he? Yep. But so am I. Damn it. Tangy, stop walking around on the desk, please. Got him. Come on. There you go. That was rough. And Lilith's on the chair. Hey. Where'd my cape go? What'd you do with my cape? These cats, man. They're trying to kill me, I think. Hey! <laughs> They're trying to kill each other. Oh. Louise's father was determined to find and save her. Sad. Is someone down here? I cannot enter. Yeah. 
It's locked. It's always locked, isn't it? Happen to vampires can't cross running water. See, Dimitri, I told you that that rule is is BS, man. Ah! Yeah. Huh. Oh my God! There's like five of them. Shit! Genuine trouble. This is bad. I realize I haven't been talking a whole lot this episode. Whoops. Okay, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I'm just having some issues with these bitches. Ah! Having issues with these guys they're, 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 uh, for scouts, they're they're pretty pretty tough. What was the point of that? What was the point of getting jumped by four of them? Okay, the door has been unlocked. That's great. Now lower the water. Lower the water more. Lower the water. Even further. There we go, full health. I love that power. I want that power. Rivet. Oh, wait, I got uh, some, like, sword or something. 142. Okay, well, when I upgrade it, it should be great, right? <laughs> Like, just thinking off the cuff, it should be spectacular. Oh, I guess that's just where I need to be. There was, wasn't there someone down there, though? I don't know. I can come back. I, w I refuse to do the final mission until everyone's dead. Look, it's Scuba! Scuba's the evil little brat. Yes, you are. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me just check the thingy on the recording software. Make sure it's... Okay, yeah, so I definitely need to end the episode soon. Who are you? Evening, sir. May I ask you what you're doing here? This I'm conducting an invest. And who? I'm Doctor. I'm Detective. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I work for the Ascalon Club. Here is my permit to go freely about the city. The Ascalon Club. You should have said so, sir. I must warn you, these streets are dangerous, and you'd better be careful. Do you know anything in particular about a man called Aloysius Dawson? Who doesn't know the man? I think he intervened personally to put an end to the police strike of last August. What else can you tell me about him? Aloysius Dawson is exactly the kind of powerful and influential man who could commit murder and get away with it. With just one phone call. No, Scuba, do not cross. Thank you. 
Goodbye. It's good bo oh, I could kill him. Wait a minute, wait! Doctor... What are you... I currently have a... Mr. Where was he? Mr. Tell me... He's a... No. Do you need medical? I'm afraid I may have co oh, Thank you. Oh, I can't mesmerize him yet. I thought I could. And I got excited because I'm like, well, he didn't give me a quest. Enter the mansion. Okay, well, this mansion? This, this, this. It's locked, all right. It's always locked. Is this even the mansion I'm, I, I should be? Okay, yeah, I guess. Wait. Okay, see? You zoom in, you find out a little something. Thought that was gonna be the door in. Come on, this is it, right? Okay, it's just a little bit this way, I guess. If he's expecting me, why is it so damn hard to find the way in? New hideout on like oh it looks like you guys are gonna have to wait till the next episode then if I can find a place to rest. If I can find a place to rest and upgrade, I'll call the episode right here. See, for some reason I can't get up top. Where I'm assuming all the stuff I need is. Hang on. I need to get upstairs. Yes, up there. That's where I need to be. Why is this difficult? Oh. Well, that's fine. That's what refill all does. It it pumps me up to the max. That's cool. What is that? Oh. Nice. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is we're about to upgrade uh, the healing ability that I have. Where is it? This. I haven't upgraded it at all. Ooh. Uh, you trade more blood to heal yourself instantly and gain an additional boost on your health regen or you trade uh, It seems like I'm gonna go both ways with it though I want instant health more than I want the other thing. Oh, I see I don't have 2700 I have 1200 ish Increase your blood capacity. You know what? I, I need to be able to gain more blood from stuff. There we go. Confirm that shit. And that's it for this episode of Vampire. Itchy. Okay, so what? I didn't even bite anybody. The docks are in critical. The hospital's in critical. Everyone's in critical. Except the West End. So that's what I'll be doing my eating. So, this has been one hell of a ride so far. And we are going to do even more damage to the world in the next one. So be sure to check in for that because I want to see you there.